What's up guys, Vern here, Poggy Boy Productions. Make sure you check out Seven Magic Mountains in Las Vegas. It's only 30 minutes away from the strip. Man, look at all these mountains. Oh my goodness, <laughs> I am in the middle of the desert in Vegas. Here we are about to check out the Seven Magic Mountains. Was it worth the drive? I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> Covered by mountains. Give me one sec. These views, though, man, I'm telling you. There it is. Can you see it? I came here early, so maybe I can get some good shots. We're here. There's a crow. There he goes. You're really in the desert. There's a couple of people behind me, but it's empty so far. I think people are starting to come. So this right here is what they call the seven magic mountains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Rainbow colored. I think an artist had this made here. And then uh from what I've read somewhere online, I think they were supposed to tear it down or something or move it, I'm not sure. But I'm glad it's still here while I'm still here in Vegas. I know Laughing Lion said this is overrated. It is. Because it's just a bunch of rocks. It kind of reminds me of if you're like a kid, right? And uh, stacking rocks. I don't know what the term is, but you know what I'm talk talking about, right? <laughs> Pretty cool, right? Just look how massive it is, man. <laughs> Get you guys a couple of drone shots, but this is a nice free thing to do in Vegas. Take pictures, post it on your social media. Pretty cool. See what I mean? Someone's been doing it over here, posting mini rocks <laughs> on top of each other. Comment down below what that art form is, I forget what it's called. But yeah, here to go, one more shot. Alright, quick tip for those of you who guys who really want to come see Seven Magic Mountains. Come early, I'm here at 7.30 in the morning. It was literally me, just with the rocks. I had the whole place to myself and it started to get crowded more people so if you have a way of to get here with either your Lyft or Uber and um, you know if there's a way for you to get here I know they do tours like this tour bus here the max tour but uh, if you want to save money yeah that's the way to go just drive here find a find a way to get here and uh, take some pictures for other free Vegas activities, check out Container Park and watch as the Mantis dances to the music and blow some smoke and fire. Fremont Street is only a few blocks down, and you can enjoy the gigantic display from above with plenty of lights, free concerts, activities, restaurants, and if you're in the mood to gamble, plenty of casinos. You can also explore the Las Vegas Strip. Plenty to see and do, especially at night.
It can get crowded though, as you can see. Check out the volcano right next to the Mirage to see a free show. This is scheduled to be demolished soon though. You can also visit the famous fountain show by the Bellagio. Yeah. Check the website for times. Here's a brief snippet. Alright, before I get a copyright strike on this video, I just want to say thank you to my lady robot friend for the narration. Saved my voice a little bit. <laughs> so, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tons of free things to do in Vegas. And if it's your first time here, make sure you subscribe down below. Hit that bell button so you get notified of all our future videos. Like, comment, share. Sharing is caring and I will see you in the next video. Thanks guys.